Hi guys, uh, welcome back. I am wanting to show you guys all of this. Look at all these leaves. I'm gonna take you around for a minute and show you just how quickly everything has changed here. Um, it is a crisp like 57 degrees here. Um, it feels really nice. You can really feel the, um, the fall in the air and the leaves, like I said, are absolutely everywhere. Um, I am actually at my grandmother's house and um just it's so it's so pretty here like all the leaves my yard doesn't have quite so many leaves because she has you know like a bunch of trees in here but it's absolutely beautiful here um you can't even walk without crunching the leaves but um it's gonna show you all these leaves it is so pretty and there are so many of them. And they just, they just fell. Um, over the past few days, there has been a lot of them. Just kind of, you can see it's covering the road and everything. Um, somebody's running a chainsaw. I wonder if you could see that if I was, okay. Anyways, sorry, once I start recording, then I can't turn the camera around, so I'm having to guess. But, um, anyways, it is a beautiful fall day here, and I hope the weather has gotten cooler for you as well. Um, and we're just really getting into that, you know, cool, spooky season weather and stuff. And, um, but anyway, yeah, it's just, it's beautiful here. And, uh, right now they're doing the fall festival um, which is right down the road from where we live at the folk school, um, that I had talked about briefly in another video about where they, you know, talk about Appalachian culture and stuff. So they've got that going. Um, and actually we had to go to town this morning to grab a couple groceries and we forgot and we came back that way. So we were sitting in traffic for a long time. Um, the traffic was completely shut off down the road where the folk school is and then all the way down the next road. Um, so it was, it was difficult getting through there, but, um, everybody's getting into those festivities. You know, they, they have a thing going on in town today, which is called paint the town fall. Um, and you can go and, um, any age can go and get paint brushes and paint and paint on the, um, like the town windows, like of shops and stuff. Cause like we have like a square, I guess is what you would call it. And there's like a bunch of stores and stuff. Um, and you can paint on their windows. Um, and they, they do have a competition and a contest and stuff, which obviously, you know, like my children, they just paint to paint. Um, I would just paint to paint because mine looks probably worse than my children's I was not gifted in, in that way um but yeah that's just something fun and like all the fall things are starting to happen and I'm hoping that we get to go to a um pumpkin patch this year I've actually never been to a pumpkin patch I've always wanted to go I've been to like um I guess places where they have them like the apple orchards like we've done apple orchard hay rides things like that but I've never been to a pumpkin patch um the kids' school is doing a trunk or treat, and this year we've actually um, offered to be in the trunk or treat, so we are decorating our trunk and giving out candy and stuff, and then they're also having a, um, a hayride, so that'll be super, super fun. Um, so, yeah, it's just like, you know, it's just a great time of year. I absolutely love it. The weather is not terrible. It's not terribly cold. It's not terribly hot. And it just feels nice to to be outside. You know, maybe you need a, like a light jacket right now, but nothing too too heavy, too serious. Um, and it's not miserably hot and stuff. So it's nice to um, to get out in and everything. And um, but anyways, so that's what we're doing. We're also discussing um, Halloween which this year my kids have changed up what they want to be. They wanted to do um, the um, Mario characters, but my boys are gonna be Power Rangers, um, the red and blue Power Rangers. I know that they probably have names, but that's what I know them by is red and blue. I don't know um, their like actual names or anything. Um, and then um, 
my daughter, I think, is going to be the um, Maribel from Encanto, like the Disney movie. Um, I think that's who she's going to be. Her hair fits perfectly, perfectly, perfectly. So, um, yeah, that's, that's going to be that. And then, look at this. Just as I was walking, uh, see that bench? The bench has been here probably longer than I have. <laughs> um, but I remember coming and sitting on it and playing for, you know, when I was younger and stuff. Um, but anyways, you know, we're debating on where to go because there's lots of things that are happening for Halloween and we're trying to figure out, like, how do we want to go about it? I think we're going to do, um, there's a street in Murphy in our town that um, shuts down and you can go door to door and um, every house on that street, um, you know, they give out candy and stuff so you can, and it's safe because they completely shut it down and it's just those kids and stuff. So I think that's I think that's what we're gonna end up doing. Last year we went um, a few towns over, and we went to like the fairgrounds and we did that. But that was so long, like the wait was so long. We had to stand in line for so long. And um, are you coming down here? You wanna come be in it with me? It's my husband. I was gonna see if he was gonna be in the video with me, but I doubt I'll convince him. Are you coming? <laughs> he might. He decided but, to come um, down here. I guess. And join me. I, <laughs> I think that's probably, is that it? That's it. <laughs> How do you feel about having to rake these leaves? I dread it. Come here. How long do you think it'll take you to rake these leaves out of your heart? It'll take me a couple hours. <laughs> He signed up for it before he saw how many leaves there actually are, and they completely cover the whole yard, so it's going to be a task. You going to do it now, or when are you going to do it? I it in a day or two. <laughs> he said, not today. But anyways, um, so that's just kind of what we have going on. What do you guys have going on? Are you guys doing anything for Halloween? Do you have any fall activities? Um, where you live, you know what, what's going on? What are you guys, what are you guys up to? Um, this tree right here is absolutely beautiful. I love the change in the weather. He's getting the pumpkins. We got pumpkins we're going to paint tonight. Um, my children and my niece are all going to paint. Speaking of my niece, my sister-in-law is due any second. She's actually due on the 30th with my second niece. Um, but we found out earlier today that she might be showing signs of labor. So she might be giving birth early. And my birthday is on the 26th of this month. So he laid them out so I could show you guys. I'll be up there in a second. So I'm going to show you guys the pumpkins that we got. Because we got some big ones from, the, from our local fruit stand. Look at this tree. Isn't it beautiful? Like the way the leaves are changing on it and everything. I absolutely love it. And with the way the sun is, is shining, you can really... You can really see the leaf changes and it's beautiful. Let's go have a look at these pumpkins. Since he did lay them out so generously for us to look at. Because I did say that, you know, I do want to show them off. They are huge. I mean, they have, they had beautiful pumpkins this year. Last year we, we got white pumpkins to paint because I thought that would work out better. Um, but it really didn't, the, the color didn't stay on it. So this year we got better paint. I think that'll, that'll help here. Are the pumpkins. Thanks for laying the pumpkins out. Here's the pumpkins. Look at that. Oh, you can see my glasses where I'm trying to look and make sure. And they are beautiful and they are huge. Look at this. <laughs> they are huge pumpkins. This one's my favorite. This one's mine. The long one. It's, let me see. If I can show you. Oh, it's heavy. It's like, it's long. It's not round. I love that. That one's definitely mine. I'm going to paint it. I didn't get small pumpkins this year. I usually get smaller pumpkins for the kids, but they were honestly about the same price. So I was like, man, might as well. Um, but anyway, so here's a, another shot of all the leaves that he gets to enjoy. But anyway, so that's just an update from us. And I want to know what's going on with you guys and everything. So see you in the next one.